Hi guys, so here we are at Kayvon Studio. We're about to start filming Red Jacket. We hope you enjoy it, so stay tuned for Making Up Art and the Red Jacket. Hi guys, um, we are here uh, with Kayvon. Uh, he is Hi. our first um, interview uh, for photography. Um, he's gonna help us make our film here and we're also gonna interview him. We were inspired by Kayvon's photography a few years ago and did some work with him. Um, so we're going to show his work uh, over the course of time and also what we've done with him. And it's going to be great. Yes. Hi, my name is Kayvon. I'm a, an Iranian-American photographer. Uh, that's the politically correct uh, way of describing me. I have been a photographer for about 40 years, officially 25. Um, somewhere in the middle, I, I became an engineer and didn't like it, so I quit. My uncle uh, did a lot of video, so he gave me his old video camera, and my dad gave me his old still camera, and for some reason I just went straight to the still and stayed there. Uh, I've been doing advertising photography for the past 25 years, and um, as the economy has changed, uh, so is the face of what I do. Uh, art? <laughs> That's a good question. Art don't pay. That's what it means to me. <laughs> That's what I found out, you know. I mean, I, I've heard, I've, I, I'd heard this before from people, and then, and then I experienced it for myself. National Geographic, short and sweet. My dad used to get uh, copies of National Geographic in Iran when I was about 10 years old. And um, I used to sit there like three days before it was about to arrive, waiting for the mailman. And, um, and as soon as it came in, right at the front stoop, I'd sit there and just stare at these pictures and just eat them up. And, uh, I think that's basically what really got me into it. I'm sure it does, subliminally. Um, I, I, I can't really point at any of my work and say, you know, if I was not Iranian, I would have not have done this shot. Um, so it's there, it's, it's kind of lurking around back there. My dad also insists that, that my engineering background also affects my photography. I love shooting people. I love working with people. I like the, I like the interaction. Um, and that's, that's the thing that really gets me going. Uh, I had a friend that was also a photographer, and she always said, if it talks back, I can't shoot it. Um, and, and for me, if it doesn't talk back, I can't shoot it. Um, when you point a camera at somebody, um, you get this, uh, they, they kind of put on this facade of what they think they look like or they should look like, um, but that's not the real them. Um, and you usually have a very short period of time to kind of break over that wall and, and get to the real person. Um, and that's where the real picture is. A picture that has soul, a picture that talks to you, um, and you kind of feel something from it, that's where the art <laughs> of it is. Do you have any words of wisdom for aspiring photographers? Don't do it! <laughs> <laughs> that's perfect.
Yes. We want to thank Kayvon so much for a fantastic day today. Go out and pick up the latest February cover of Connecticut Magazine because it's Kayvon's. And stay tuned for our project with Kayvon. See ya. Yay. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> 